So you just installed your rear view mirror dash cam and you've realized there's so much reflections coming through the mirrors. Now let me show you how to fix this. Hello guys, welcome to another video. So today's video is going to be a very, very, very short video. Um, so it's just to show you guys a simple way to cut down the reflections coming through your rear view mirror dash cam. So let's get to it. So the normal position you'd always have your rear view mirror is having it directly opposite the um, windscreen at the back. So in a sense, you are adjusting it so that you can actually see the whole of your rear windscreen. Now, if you're installing a mirror dash cam, you don't want to do that because when you do that, you'd notice that you are having the light from the rear windscreen coming straight directly to the dash cam. And in that way, you're seeing what's behind you from the rear windscreen as well as what's being shown from the dash cam. Now, the solution to this is very simple. If you haven't watched my video on the Togad CE70 rear view dash cam, click on the link somewhere on your screen above or below or check in the description on this video to watch that. Now, I'll also be making another video comparing the CE70 from Togad and the CE60 from Togad as well, which is the one I'm showing on this video. So yeah, let's get back to the solution. So all you need to do is just readjust your rear windscreen or sorry, readjust your rear view mirror. So turn it down instead of straight towards your rear windscreen, just like I did that. Now, if you do that, you would see that it would dramatically reduce the reflection you're getting. It's just as simple as that. So turn that wind, I mean, sorry, turn that rear view mirror down so that your dash cam is not facing your rear windscreen and that way the light coming from the rear windscreen is not hitting directly on the surface of your dash cam the result you'll be getting is a lot better than what you see from the camera so um yes it's going to cut a lot of the reflections away and you'd be able to make use of the video being fed through to your dash cam this is a problem you come across mostly during the day because of the sunlight but at night your dash cam would be very well fine so yeah if you're watching this video i'm assuming you more or less want to use the digital display from your dash cam during the day rather than turning it off and just using the camera to record so yeah if you like to use the digital camera itself then this is what you need to do to reduce that reflection dramatically but remember, if you've adjusted your dash cam so that you can see the display without the reflection, if you decide to turn that off and just use the mirror, then obviously you'd need to readjust your rear view mirror so that you can see directly from the rear of the car. And that is just the simple solution. And you can go ahead and enjoy your dash cam. So guys, Remember, if you find this video useful or if you've enjoyed this video, please don't forget to click the subscribe button, like the video, share it to your friends and families and leave a comment below. Also, don't forget to turn on your notification button so that you can get notified whenever I upload new videos. So take care guys and see you in the next video.